we'll try it again. Here was the um, here was the arrangement from Monday night. I went ahead and added a few more balls and finished that up. That's on a charger plate. Thank you, dear. I appreciate it. Because poor Esther came on just to share and I'm just going to ignore the screen then. All right. I didn't know if I was going to be back late or what. So thank you. Thank you. So I went ahead and I already did my bows. This is a custom order for a customer. And the other night, um, she kept sharing what she wanted on it. <laughs> so this is my sign. I'll be home for Christmas. And I do have snow owls. I only have, ouch, poor guy got clipped back there with the glue gun. Sorry about that, buddy. Woo. So now the owl matches the height. I only have four in my shop, but I have more coming. So we're going to use that today because she requested a snow owl. She wanted lots of ribbons. She wanted a pine wreath. So what I did with this bow, I used the three, two, three bow. Look at those colors together. Awesome. And Yvonne, Levon, everything's good. Thank you. I made his little hat. Isn't that cute? See a little pom pom and a little fur on his hat. <laughs> yeah, I burned his bum. <laughs> uh. Wow, thank you. Good to see you on here, Carla. We had some major technical difficulties, so we were giving it another shot. Monday night's live was is total waste. So, all right, so we've got three bows on here, two small ones, a larger one, and we've got some glitter on this one. Now I'm knocking everything down. Do you ever have one of those weeks? Well, this is one of those weeks. It's been one of those months. But I'm here to say I made it through today's appointment and everything is good. We are good. So that was the hurdle I needed to get over. And I'm over it. So we're moving on. All right, so our little owl, we're going to put him right in here. So I want some tinsel tie. All my owls that I'm selling will already come with the tinsel tie attached. So you won't have to do that. So don't watch. It's going to be painful. I have to stab them. I'm sorry. Right? It has been really bad. But a few of my friends have had my back and said, just keep moving on. So, I'm moving on. I'm going to put a little glue in here so it stays where it's supposed to. I know. Oh, no. A lot of hammering going on, I'm sure.
mine's just been health issues. Everything that could go wrong has gone wrong. So, but we got the okay that we're good today. So, all right. And then I got some goodies to show you because after my appointment today, I went for some retail therapy and then my girlfriend took me out to breakfast. And then I got to see my grandson. So that made everything go away. All the worries of the last week, all the fear, everything. So we're good. All right, so we're going to put our, our snow owl on here. Isn't he cute? I mean, look, even his eyes match the sign. So I want him right above the bow here. And I should have taken a picture of the wreath I saw today during my appointment. It was the worst wreath I've ever seen. It wasn't even a, like an AC Moore special. <laughs> It was, the bow was all bent up. It, it was so dusty and so disgusting that I told her, I said, I'm going to make you a wreath and bring it in because this, this wreath looks really bad. Oh no. I don't know if that's a good thing having me on your TV. Alright. So, the customer requested lots of bows and balls and pine cones. So, by the time I had set it out for her to show her, I didn't really have any place for some pine cones. So, I ended up putting them in the middle of the bow and she loved it. So, that's what we're going with. We're going with the pine cones in the middle of the bow. She loved it because I thought where am I gonna put these there's like no room to put them so what the customer wants the customer gets it's my breeder she's an awesome awesome mentor and shoulder to cry on and available three o'clock in the morning when you're having a problem with a litter so whatever she wants she's gonna get and this is what she wanted so I'm I'm thrilled to be making this for her because she's a pretty darn special lady And these are like snow tipped pine cones. So I need another. Then she wanted some snowflakes in here. I have these silver ones. These are from, I think, Big Lots last year. But I also found some white ones today. No problem. Thank you, Jean. And I can't wait to see what you did with your your snowflake wreath. I wasn't sure if I'd like these. I think I'm going to stick with the silver ones. I also found some blue ones at Joanne's. But again, I think I'm going to stick with the silver. I like those. All right. 
And then where I would put a snowflake, I also have some pine with some glitter on. So, let me just kind of stick these in here. And then I'll know where I, where I want to be. This guy's got to go down a little. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue this down in here. Actually, I'm going to trim some of it first. I don't need all of that. And I'm going to put a little glue. And I'm going to wrap some of this pine around the glue to hold it in place. And then I'm going to attach my snowflake to that. Actually, I'm going to put it just below it. Right there. Try to stop slamming that down. I know I'm slamming it and I should be. Alright. Now. Kind of twisting the pine around the the um, wire. A little glue in here. And then our snowflake. Move it around. Oh, aren't you sweet? No problem. Totally understand. I know what you've been going through. And you know what I've been going through. <laughs> I needed to read today. But you know what? The best part about today was my girlfriend saying, I'm taking you out to breakfast. And my grandson saying, Nana. He actually said, Nana. And that's what he calls me. So... As bad as everything got this week, that just wiped it all away. He said Nana. And I wanted to be called Mumum, and they said, no, that's cl too close to Mom. And he's been saying Nana. So, going to make me cry again. Because <laughs> that, that's just so special. All right, now let's get some balls, lots of balls. Now I'm going to do like groups of three, like I'm going to have a silver one, a blue one, and a white one. So let's start gluing some balls. I'm gonna get I'm gonna put like five sections of balls on because I really want to glam this up for her. She lives in Texas. And this is the first time she's asked me to make her wreath. I have made her a sign for her porch that I personalized. And put some Yorkies on it. I think I'm going to have to move this. I think I want this down here further. Yes, I do. All right. There. 
He's my little sweetie pie. He's Nana's boy. All right, so we got a big one. We'll go with a small one. Yeah. Oh, duh. All right. <laughs> I swear to God. Uh, taking this off because dummy me forgot to put on the sign. Oh my gosh. See what I mean? This week it's going to go down in the books. This being one of the worst weeks ever. So, that's going to reposition some things. <sighs> I give up. So, let me see. Where do I want to put the snowflake? I knew that was too big of a gap there, that something wasn't right. All right. That snowflake's going to go right over here. Jeez. And this is the third time I glued this. Thank you. All right. So let's do another ball set like right here. Try this again. nice with the pine you can just glue the the balls right to the pine yes that is my sign and then I purchased the owls and made the um, the owls hat to match the one on the sign and I have which I didn't show everybody on Monday night. I have a whole new batch of signs to show. Um, they're not on my Etsy shop, in my Etsy shop yet. This is, so, I think what I wanna do now, I wanna move this over to here. See, and then I can reposition these. Yeah, um, this one I actually made into a flag also. It says, Cowboys, or Cowbells Ring, are you listening? I love my cows, and I have brown um, cow, cow spot ribbon. This one says, I just want hot cocoa with marshmallows. This is my buffalo print. Um, sign collection. Yes, I love the blue at Christmas. This one is Let It Snow, Let It Snow, Let It Snow. My other buffalo plaid. And I have two more to that line. This one is Walking in a Winter Wonderland. And then this one says, Merry Christmas. Oops. There. So these will be available in my shop. This one is available in my shop. I have a new breast cancer one too. It's in there now. Um, I also have 
a lot of my um, upright signs can be made into um, flags, garden flags. So I have those listed. All right, now we're gonna put this back where it should have been. Since I forgot to put my sign on. This I want right in here, kind of sticking out this way. Take a little bit of this off. And I'm still, you're still hearing the sound okay, right? I know, and I found marshmallows on Amazon. And they're really a nice size. So, I hope to do that one next week. But I want to do my um, breast cancer one. Because... I want to donate it to the breast cancer center at the hospital because that wreath was putrid. They agreed with me that it was really bad, but they still have it up. So I need to um, I need to get it out of there. So that's the plan. Now, let's see. I think I'm gonna like move this over this way and put a group of balls here and maybe move this over to here and then put another group there. So, I kind of like mixing the frosted with some of the other ones. Um, there's different kinds. So, do like one of these. All right, so we'll do a set here. Uh oh, I think I'm some heads are thinking. Well, even if you made your um, made your marshmallows out of that stuff, you made your candies out of Levon. I think that would be cute. And did you see Door with Door's um, decor? She's making little carts for candy, little wood carts, like for um, candy setups, you know. I don't know if anybody saw them yet, but boy, are they cute. All right, now I'm going to put the other snowflake right here. I should have waited. But I'm not paying attention. My whole day has just been off. Okay, there we go. And I apologize for that. Anybody get to see Venus this morning with the crescent moon? I got to see it this morning. It was pretty. All right. Now we'll put one right here. And then we'll do some balls and then some more balls. I'm going to trim this. We don't want that ball of glue. There we go. Yep, some fake beaks. I'll show you the marshmallows when they come in. They should be in tomorrow. Um, I ordered them, and they're a nice size. They're not the real tiny ones. They're a nice size, so I thought they would look nice scattered throughout the wreath. All right. There we 
we go. And then we'll put some balls over here and then the last section over there. So, I'm thinking, here we go. I already posted several wreaths on my Facebook page that um, people have designed. I think I want this big blue one over here. There's a few designs that were made with this um, sign. So everybody's really enjoying the blue. I love the blue. three over here. So then we've got like five sections of balls. We've got our triangle with our snowflakes. We got our triangle with our ribbon, our bows. So we're right where I want to be. And this is the way she wanted it. So that's all that matters. Yeah, I love the buffalo print with the black. I think that really makes it pop on the sign. There we go. Very easy peasy. Stay there. She's loving it. I know she is. <laughs> that would be nice. A dash of cinnamon. Yeah, I I added the cup. And I added the white border. And see, you could even throw in some peppermint sticks. Now, this doesn't necessarily have to be Christmas. This can be winter because there's snowflakes on the cup. So it's like a not so much a Christmas sign as it is a winter sign. All right. Let me show you some of my items that I picked up at Joann's today. Like I said, I needed some retail therapy after my appointment, so. And the marshmallows were pretty reasonable. I think it, on Amazon, it was a bag of like 24 of them for like five something. They were marked down. So. Now I got these, but I, I, could add them if I wanted, but I would want them darker. I would want them darker to match the um, the balls and the ribbon. But they had these. These are Bloom Holiday Picks, and these were 99 cents, and then they were marked down 40% um, off, and then I got an additional 20% at the cash at the register. But I thought these were nice. Because I'm always touching these balls to make sure they're not styrofoam. And these were not. They had them in silver. They had them in white. They also had them in this like blush copper color too that I liked. So I grabbed some of those. These were 70% off because these were considered um, fall. And I did use some of those on my gnome wreath. Um, I used the gray ones. These are considered fall, but you could go ahead and glitter those 
and use them in a Christmas wreath too. So these were 70% off. These were the ones I used in my um, Halloween gnome wreath. This one here. See? They're right down in there. So they could go with anything. So we got those at 70% off, and they were originally $2.99, so it was 70% off that. Then they had these, and these were $1.99 with 40% off and then 20% off the total. So I thought these kind of worked well with these. They're kind of like a coppery color, or would you... It's not really a rose gold. It's more like a brown. So I like those. And they came with the holly leaves. So I got some of those. Then there's another silver one. Then I got the snowflakes in silver, white, like an iridescent, and then the blue. And like I said, they were 99 marked down 40% off so so that's what I got that oh and another coupon and a list a mile long I must get tired of replacing the tape so all in all I think I got stuff that will work with what I have coming up I really like these. I think they really look different. I love the color of those. And I think they're gonna look nice in a in a green pine wreath. And like I said, these aren't the styrofoam, these are the hard kind. So they're not gonna pop and break. And then I got more blue fabric because I have more orders for the um, for the snow owl hat, so I had to get more fabric. So there we go. We are done, and you can still hear. Hi, Dawn. Yes, that would be an idea. Paint them pink. All right, so again, the new signs are, I just want hot cocoa with my marshmallows. <laughs> Let it snow. Cowbells ring, are you listening? I can't wait to do this one because I have the brown cow spot ribbon. And walking in a winter wonderland. And then Merry Christmas. I kind of liked this gold with the green holly there we go i thought that was different and did did dawn did you do your um did you do your wreath yet with your i still had it here somewhere with your mouse Yes, I do. Not even a mouse. Did you finish your mouse wreath? Because we want to see that when you're done. Oh, and I found these at Big Lots last week. They're little barns. I thought they would be cute. And that was $3 for a pack of three. Even though I could probably make those on my CNC machine, it was like I wasn't going to take up the time to do it. So, No, not yet. Well, send it to me when you're done. All right. I think that's it. We'll work on a cancer, breast cancer one for... Monday night, and then hopefully my marshmallows will be in for Wednesday, and we'll do the marshmallow wreath. Does anybody have any questions? 
The owl is in the shop already with the sign. You can buy it without the sign. You can buy it with the sign, however you want. He's cute and he's lightweight. And he's got the black nose and the same color e eyes as the sign. Thank you, thank you, Carla. This is exactly how she wanted it, so. Because it was funny, I kept dry fitting everything and taking a picture, and then she said, no, I want more of this. No, I want pine cones. No, I, so I had to keep adjusting it. But I had the one ribbon made, and she wanted more ribbon. So, and I love this ribbon. It has the um, glittered snowflakes and the fuzz on the sides. And then I had this like denim and the uh, black and white check. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, LaVon. Yeah, I, I was a setting on my phone, I think, but I'm still getting the message across my phone telling me that it's clipped. So, I don't know. I'm so done with it, with technical stuff this week. I need a break. So, all right. We are finished. I will see you Monday night at 6. Hopefully, we won't have any technical difficulties then either. Yes. Yeah, but Monday night it kept kicking me off. So, I don't know. Thank you, Nanny Dot. Thank you. This is headed off to Texas. So, and if you live local, make sure you enter to win the wreath giveaway from KBS Computers. He bought five of my wreaths to give away. So, if you don't live local and you want to participate, go ahead and participate. And then I could ship it to you. Yeah, that's my breeder in Texas, Tina. She's awesome. This is what she wanted. So, this is how she wanted it. So, we're good. And shake test, nothing's coming off. So we are good. All right. I'll see y'all Monday night. And thanks for popping back on and hanging out with me and spreading the love. I appreciate it. All right. Have a good evening. Bye-bye.